welcome back to part two of decorating our downstairs toilet if you did miss part one of this it will be the video before this one if you want to go back and check it out so the first thing we did was start filling in the holes that were in the wall this was because when we moved in there was a handrail on this wall i will insert a picture here so you can see exactly what the bathroom was like before we moved in this was something that i really wanted to get stuck into so i got callum to show me how to fill the holes in the wall properly i know it's not exactly rocket science but you know it's always good to have a demonstration after we filled those holes in we then went around the rest of the bathroom and started taking off all the shelves and all the toilet roll holder and everything like that which a lot of them did come off very easy because a lot of them were even screwed in also if you're wondering why we both pulled this face it's because grayson was asleep upstairs and we were so worried this was going to wake him up then we made a start taking this bathroom cabinet off the wall now both of us thought this cabinet was going to be a lot heavier than it was and it wasn't actually that heavy at all then me being the diy queen i am went round and filled all the holes in with the filler i actually really enjoy this job i'm not gonna lie also if anybody's wondering why i'm wearing a dress and sunglasses doing some diy then it's because we were only filling a few holes in and to be honest i couldn't be bothered to get changed we then moved on to the sink area of the bathroom and started off by taking the light off the wall that's above the mirror and we also took off the mirror as well we then also started to pull off this little bit of wallpaper that was just above the sink i'm not really sure why they had just that little patch but it just didn't make sense to me then the final thing we did was just fill in the last few little holes that needed filling and that was all we did in the bathroom today it was actually quite late at this point so we thought we'd call it a day and it was a good time to let the filler dry overnight if you do enjoy watching these kind of series then stay tuned for part three